Sorry to call you out here. While I accepted Luca's generous invitation the last time, I feel it would be dangerous for me to frequent your hideout. There's a good chance the team surveilling me will notice. We appreciate your consideration. Wataru told me what happened in Ceyron. I've also given the government a report that won't affect our activities. What? Is that safe? Your family is spring pharmaceuticals. That's precisely why I did. Reporting my own family's wrongdoings only gets the government to trust me more. Besides, Karin and I were the first ones to propose that research facility. What? I think you already know about Alice. She's still being held in that facility as an other. We enticed Ceyron in order to protect her, knowing full well they would abuse their research. The results of which were the ampules and the uprising. We were fools. What's going on with this country? Ceyron may have incited an uprising, but there's still a new Himuka city just like ours. Suo's conducting human experiments, and Ceyron is basically doing the same thing. All of it being done to develop new weapons to fight the threat of the others. One chose to strengthen powers, and one explored a method to control the others themselves. What are others, anyway? I've heard they suddenly began appearing after the Spring of Extinction, but not much is known about them still. That's true. I guess the only other thing we know is that they're created in the Extinction Belt. Some are saying they're wild animals that experience sudden mutations, but are they really wild? It's very possible that the government is hiding what they actually are. That is the crux of it. Huh? Even the public can sense something different about the others. So, focusing on that point will nullify the government's personality rehabilitation efforts. Like exposing a government secret to every new Himuka citizen? Just like my brother did in the uprising. Exactly. Karan and I once plotted to send a video of a human at the moment of being metamorphosed straight to the minds of every citizen. But we couldn't find any definitive video to serve as our evidence, and I was hampered after they threatened Karin. So that's why you let the government turn you into a spy? Yes, but now they should have Nagi's data from when Naomi was metamorphosed for research purposes. They took his memory when they subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Now that you mention it, Nagi seemed like he had no idea about Naomi's metamorphosis after he was discharged from the hospital. But, but wouldn't that cause brain damage? Extracting a specific memory is a dangerous process, but that's hardly even a concern to them. You all have the same memory of her metamorphosis, but attempting to digitize and extract it is too risky. That's why we need Nagi's stored memory data. It's already been extracted. We can send the data via Arahabaki to every citizen as proof of the government's inhumane acts. The people are ready to hear it. Can you access it? Yes. I received permission to enter the secure site while you were heading out to Ceyron on your last assignment. I've been provided with a one-time use pass. Nagi's stolen memory. Where is it stored? I think they're storing it in the old OSF hospital you infiltrated before. I'm sorry for not having more concrete intel, but that facility was used to research powers. It's very likely it's there. Could you infiltrate the old hospital after the platoon has been reorganized? Reorganized? Uh, I forgot about that. I'm... I'm staying in Yuita platoon. This isn't... This isn't the world I want either. I see. So Hanabi is the only one that needs to be transferred. No, I'll stay too. Are you sure? Staying with us could mean being targeted by the government. Then we'll deal with it if it comes to that. After all the awful things we learned, I can't just sit here and do nothing while my friends are trying to do something about it. You don't care if it brings trouble to your family? No. And... I'm actually starting to suspect that it wasn't just my uncle who knew, but my father too. Thank you, Hanabi. Your help means a lot to me. I'll leave you to recover Nagi's memory from Naomi's metamorphosis. I'd like to go myself, but I don't want them revoking my access to Arahabaki, so I have to lay low for now. 
You've made a lot of waves, Yuito. You need to be careful. This will be your second time infiltrating the hospital. Yes, I will. By the way, I can send you some data to help you bypass the old hospital security system. I may not be as good as my sister, but I can still put together a program or two. Please use this to aid your infiltration. Thank you. Well, good luck. I'm with you, Commander Yuito. I'm really glad the whole platoon was able to work as a team. We're all in this together. Finishes the job. No problems to report. Resource reading is close. Should we get it? I need your help. That other is the one we're after. What do you want to do? Leave it to me! That was brilliant. Here, it must be deeper inside the building. Probably somewhere very hard to get to.
The brother is still around. Use SAS to find him. It is nothing. You should be able to break the outer shell and keep attacking. I can disrupt the security system with Major General Fubuki's program. You can proceed safely. Understood. Come on. Let's regroup! Training is paying off. I need 
Looks like there's a resource nearby. It sprayed something like oil. Don't get it on you. I can hit it! It's over! Here we 
Do you remember the layout of the building? You were admitted to this hospital when you were little. Uh, that's what I hear, but I don't remember it at all. I guess I was too young. Let's regroup! Do you need help? Maybe Sugumi's clairvoyance. The is turned invisible, you. but I can still see it. Try using clairvoyance. Now die! Come on! Finish this, Yuito! Do you need help?
I need your help. We'll be able to move forward if we use my power, Yuito. There's a resource reading near here. What do you want to do? Yes, my power. Come on. I'll protect 
I'm using this, Sugumi! <laughs> something rare. Your help. 
Source reading is close. Should we get it? It doesn't look like they're storing data anywhere. I don't even see anything resembling research equipment. I think the facility is underground, but there weren't any stairs leading down from the first floor. We'll just have to comb the area ourselves. 
If this is where they conducted his personality rehabilitation, Nagi's data should be here. I wonder if Nagi managed to get away. I had all of you there to rescue me, but he was alone. You're still as kind as ever. Nagi! You did come back. Of course you did. I mean, we're best friends, aren't we? Looks like Nagi received even more personality rehabilitation. Because Nagi was regaining his original personality the last time we saw him? Personality rehabilitation. You traitors against glorious new Himuka are the ones who need rehabilitation, not me! There's no need to worry, Yuito. They specifically told me you need to be alive when I bring you in! I need you, Gemma. Stop it, Nagi. I don't want to fight you. Then come with me. We wouldn't have to fight then. Of course, I'll kill anyone else who gets in my way. So what's it gonna be? I didn't know Nagi could fight this one. If we don't use SAS, we don't have a chance. Endure it. I'll take care of it. Don't let the personality rehabilitation control you, Nagi. You can tell he's your friend. That's why I'm doing this. I'm steering my friend to the right path. There's nothing I can't do! I've seen a lot of people whose personalities suddenly change like that. I should have started investigating earlier. If you did, you, you would have been personality rehabilitated too. Let's do our best to stop him for now. Use this!
Please stop this! <laughs> Too bad for you, I'm not done yet! Yeah. <laughs> Guys! Not again. If I pass out during the fight. Yuito, I know that was scary. They're all done with the tests now. Honest. Let me see that brave face. You're okay. It's all over. Dream? About my mom? Why would I have that now? Oh, right. This ceiling. It looks like the hospital room from when I was a kid. The smell, too. Smell? Where am I? <laughs> huh? I can't use my powers? You can't use your powers here. Those restraints are designed to nullify your abilities. You're such a fool. All you had to do was play the patriotic hero, and you would have had the world on a platter. Who are you? Just a humble staff member of this facility. We've met a number of times when you were a child, but I'm sure you don't remember. We did? Have you forgotten about your time here in the hospital with your mother? Which means, this is still somewhere inside the old OSF hospital. Where are my friends? No idea. Your friends are outside my jurisdiction. I'm in charge of duds. You mean people without powers? That's right. I was in charge of the experiments involving you and the Travers brothers. Unlike Karin and Luca, it seems like your psionic hormone levels are dropping. What? Now that I think about it. Your psychokinesis was activated under some unconventional circumstances. Duds have an extremely low chance of manifesting powers in the first place. This could mean there's something special about your cerebrum. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Wait, I'm a dud? Oh, so you're missing your memories from when you were a dud too. This is going to be tricky. It seems your brain is accumulating damage as you use your power. I need to run some tests before I ask you any questions. I'm sure you've experienced episodes of sudden memory loss or having difficulty remembering your childhood. Wait! Please, explain it to me so I can understand. <sighs> it's simple. You were born a dud. Then you were hospitalized here with your mother because this was still the OSF hospital at that time. We know that duds are capable of acquiring potent powers. The country sends all duds to this hospital, where we run medical experiments on them. I'm a dud? I had no powers? In any case, it's time to go back to sleep. <laughs> Damn it! I can't stay awake. Yuito! <sighs> Are you all right? Major General Fubuki? How... The program he gave us was able to tap into the facility's surveillance camera feed. I knew it would be dangerous infiltrating this place. 
I made sure I would be available if something happened. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are all right. I'm sorry, Major General. We couldn't get Nagi's memory data. Uh, right, Nagi. What happened after that? You suddenly collapsed, and Nagi... He took you, and then used you as... as a hostage. We were afraid of hurting you, so we couldn't attack him. We were locked inside a room. There was strange equipment. I think it was for personality rehabilitation. The Major General Fubuki showed up before any of us were rehabilitated, so we're all okay. You don't have to worry about us. Sorry. You're always rescuing me. Thanks, guys. Wait. It looks like... others are gathering. I've disconnected the alarm, but they should already know Yuito's trying to get away. We have to escape the hospital. I've already shared the way out with Wataru. I'll hold them off here. But... Don't forget, I'm a Septentrion. I can handle myself. Take this. Don't lose it. No matter what. What is it? I'll tell you when we get out of here. Now go! You'll only get in my way. Okay. I don't see any safe area near here for teleporting. We have to run. Got it. Please, be careful. <laughs>